John Britt. I've been a potter for about 30 years. I'm from Dayton, Ohio, and um, but now I live in North Carolina, and um, I've been mainly concentrating lately on glazes. So I wrote uh, three books on glazes. One's a complete guide to high fire glazes, and then most recently the complete guide to mid range glazes. And I have another one called Quest for the Elusive Leaf Bowl, which is a collection of articles that I've written over the years and had in Ceramics Monthly and Studio Potter and a variety of magazines. Uh, but I thought I would do a video today on uh, basic throwing, because I think sometimes uh, the videos that you get out there are uh, pretty project oriented and pretty uh, fa fast. They go, they fly right over the centering and uh, cylinders and stuff. So I thought, well, maybe I'd do something very basic for people who are either starting out or have been doing it for a year or so, and they're just getting the s sense of how um, to improve their throwing. Uh, and all, it could be for people maybe a couple years in who have been sort of stagnated a little bit. And then this will give you a jump start on how to improve things and uh, get uh, some height out of your uh, uh, so, uh, like a clay, like say you were throwing a pound of clay and you could only get it six inches. Well, we'll have some exercises that help you get it taller than that. All right, so I'll show you uh, not only the throwing of cylinders and some exercises, but also some tools that I use and also just like the variety of tools that are out there. So sometimes you can become like overwhelmed by what to get. So uh, I basically use about seven tools exclusively and then I will mix in other tools just for uh, unusual things or just to keep keep things interesting. Uh, we'll also talk a little bit about bats and what kind of bats you use on a wheel. We'll talk about types of wheels. Uh, I do a lot of throwing standing up and so I like that and um, then we'll probably go into a little bit of how to wedge clay because uh, a lot of times you get clay from a box uh, from a supplier and uh, people just start right in but it's good good to know how to wedge us uh, to like need like kneading bread dough you wedge it and that helps prepare it to, and makes throwing easier and then we'll uh, just show you ways to cone clay on the wheel and then um, uh, pull uh, opening and pulling a cylinder and then I'll have exercises on how to get better, like uh, do a three pull method, a 20 second or 30 second pulls, uh, maybe then like one pound balls and how to throw those tall and using a variety of clays. And uh, then a little bit of trimming, not, not much, but just to show you how the finished pot would look and then how to put a handle on real quick. And then in subsequent videos, I'll, I'll go more into detail of each of those things. Thank you. 